Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. EastEnders star Tracy Ann Oberman's brutal swipe at the soap has resurfaced, following the news that she will be making a surprise return later this year. The actress, 57, is set to reprise her role as Chrissy Watts for a short stint this autumn, nearly two decades after her last appearance. However, while bosses have no doubt welcomed Tracy Ann back to the soap with open arms, the actress previously slamming the show's grueling schedules and demanding storylines after her exit. Tracy Ann also questioned the wild storylines bosses penned for her character, who famously murdered her father Dirty Den Watts. She told the Radio Times in 2006, each executive producer brought in new writing teams. It was a challenge, particularly when the storylines made you laugh out loud. You imagined the writer must have been on crack when they wrote it. In 2006, after welcoming her first child, she also told the Mirror, you could say I've left these tenders and I've got my life back. I don't think it would have been possible to have a baby when I was doing that show. In my first year I was in 139 out of 146 episodes, so I was on this massive wave. A coterie of others were working just as hard, Jesse Wallace, Shane Ritchie, Nigel Harmon, and we all walked around looking ashen-faced. Mail Online has contacted a representative for EastEnders for comment. On Wednesday, it was announced that Tracy Ann is set to return to EastEnders after almost two decades, to reprise her role as the infamous Chrissy Watts. Chrissy was last seen on the BBC soap in December 2005, when was sent to prison for the murder of her husband Den Watts, played by Leslie Grantham. She had first joined the soap in April 2004 and quickly became a prominent figure and racking up a huge list of enemies, including Kate Mitchell, Jill Hapeny, and Kat Slater, Jesse Wallace. But her biggest storyline saw her bludgeon her dirty den to death in self-defense in the show's special 20th anniversary episode. The infamous moment was watched by a staggering 14.34 million people, with almost 60% of possible viewers tuning in. Alongside Sam Mitchell, Kim Medcalf, and Zoe Slater, Michelle Ryan, Chrissy attempted to cover up the murder, burying Den under the floor of the Vic Barrel store. She managed to get away with her crime for months, living with Den's beloved adoptive daughter, Sharon Watts, Letitia Dean, and his son Dennis Rickman, Nigel Harmon. But when Sam drunkenly dug up the body, she was held responsible for the murder until Phil, Steve McFadden, and Grant Mitchell, Ross Kemp, returned to help their sister and uncovered the truth, with Chrissy being sent to prison. Speaking about her return to the soap, Tracy Ann gushed, Chrissy Watts was such a great character to play, a victim or a villain. She is a real fan favorite so, when Chris Clenshaw asked me to come back and revisit her and see what has happened in the last 19 years, I jumped at the chance. The scripts are fantastic and I hope the viewers enjoy her as much as I am enjoying playing her again. While executive producer Chris Clenshaw said, I'm delighted to welcome the immensely talented Tracy Ann back to the iconic role of Chrissy Watts. Although the character hasn't been seen on screen for almost 20 years, Chrissy is cemented in EastEnders' rich history for her murder of Walford's most infamous villain and Sharon's beloved father, Dirty Denver. I'm keeping tight-lipped on the exact circumstances relating to her return for the time being, but what I can promise is that it's never quiet when Chrissy Watts is around. It comes after Chris teased the soap would see the return of several beloved characters ahead of the 40th anniversary celebrations next year. EastEnders was created by Julia Smith and Tony Holland and premiered on February 19, 1985. In recent years, the soap has delighted fans with the returns of Kathy Beale, Cindy and Peter Beale, and Lauren Branning. And showrunner Chris has teased that more familiar faces will swing by Walford in the lead-up to the anniversary. He told The Sun, as we head towards our 40th year, I think the nostalgic element means a lot. Into the autumn and the end of the year, we've got quite a few treats coming up. Asked if that meant a return for long-departed characters, Chris coyly replied, maybe. It all depends on the story and where the characters are. But it h.